What's cracking YouTube? My name's Brody and welcome to another Pokemon trading card game opening and today we are back with a black and white series Kyurem box. So just recently on the channel we've actually opened up the Zekrom and the Reshiram versions of this box. So this box actually comes in a trio which is pretty pretty cool. So basically what these, um, what these boxes come with is four boost packs, a promo and a rather large figure. And I really love the figures that come in this one. So hopefully this Curon one, once we get hands on, will look just as good. But it says just there, the Boundary Pokemon is your legendary ally in the Pokemon TCG Curon box. But yeah, I'll leave that for you guys to pause and have a read of. Hopefully I'm not um, putting that in the way of my face. But yeah, so you just got Curon on the back there. And then kind of like a nice design all over the box. Curon just chilling in the corner there. It says what it includes just over there. But yeah, first thing I noticed when I look at this box while I get it all opened up was that it actually has a Next Destinies pack in this box. Um, and the other ones just had four Emerging Powers booster packs. So that was definitely a, I don't know, a standout in my opinion. I kind of just like looked at it and it was like, ooh, that's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. And it looks like we also have a black and white base booster pack as well. So let's get this open because yeah it is a rather large box so we've got the we've got the promo here I'm gonna give this code away as well um, throw back in a half for you guys enjoy there is the the Curum box code as you guys can see it's got like the nice design of the Curum on the back yet back there enjoy hopefully you guys get something nice from that one I don't don't really know exactly what that one will give you probably um, four boost packs or just the promo or something like that but yeah, so there's the boost packs, and we've got the figure. I'll just get this rubbish here, the plastic, out of the way. And then we'll have a look at everything up nice and close and personal here on the on the hand cam. But look at that. So, cool. So once again, you've got a nice little stand here. Um, let's see if we can figure out how to stand Curum up on here. So I'm guessing it's just the two feet in there like that I'll leave that on cam so you guys can see what's going on but yeah there we go so Kieran's got this pretty epic like lizard like stance almost if you know what I mean and yeah it just looks like that so that's pretty cool let me know in the comment section below what you guys think of that Kieran figure I think uh, I think my favorite would still have to be the restaurant one but yeah this one is pretty cool it's not quite as large as the other ones as well too. So yeah, that's pretty cool. Let's have Kieran kind of just chilling up the back there. Maybe just off to the side like that. Something like that will do. But yeah, so then we've got the Kieran promo as well. It's got 130 HP with Outrage and Glaciate. It's black and white 44. And yeah, once again, this is a hollow, but the hollow foil is very hard to tell. Like all three of these um, hollow foil promos have been rather hard to tell if it is a hollow or not. But it definitely is. So I'll throw that one up the back there to continue our little Curum theme here. But yes, as I was saying, um, so there's the next Destiny's pack art with the Zekron back art. Then we've got the Emerging Powers packs here. We've got the Braviary, Cabalion, and we've got another Zekron back art with a black and white base. So I'm going to go from black and white base, we'll go through Emerging Powers, and then finish off on next destinies because this pack is feeling rather thick i'm gonna i'm just gonna say it is feeling rather thick so hopefully we can get some hype pulls out of this box today if you guys are keen to see what we get be sure to drop a like down below but with that said let's get straight into these packs and hope for the finest of pulls so it looks like this black and white black and white base pack is one without the codes because there was two separate prints to black and white base one with the codes and one without so let's go so we're kicking it off with a potion, a little common potion here, a Sandal, Tepig, oh a Lightning Energy, cool, a Zorua, Pignite, a Bufflant, a Clang, a Reverse Duosion, cool, cool. So we're still rocking like the Diamond and Pearl Hollow Foil as well, which is interesting. But that one has Recover and Rollout, not bad, and a Galvantula. Regular rare, so this one has 80 HP with electro rare, electro web and leech life. But yeah, nothing too too crazy, which was expected from black and white base there. 
But next up, we've got the Emerging Powers Pack, and if you guys missed out on the Reshiram box, I, I believe it was, we got an epic pull out of Emerging Powers. Let's just leave that one there. Yeah, be sure to go check out the links in the description of the video if you guys would like to see what we got out of that. But there is the Emerging Powers code. Let's throw that one off to the side. Three and two, and let's go. So we've got a Cub Chew, bless you. And then we've got a Rog and Roller, Drilba, a Pan Sage, a Minchino, Krokorok. That's pretty cool. I really like that art. That looks really nice. Really nice. A Sork. Once again, actually, that one looks really cool too. I like that. I like these arts. That is that is awesome. We've got a Wellipede. We've got a Reverse Woobat with Cybolt. That one's just a common. And a Levani. A Levani. <laughs> Regular Rare with uh, 130 HP with Nurturing and X Scissor. I love how Levani just has that big blowout. It's like Levan. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> we've got a Cabalion pack art here. Here. So we've got nothing all too hype today, you guys. Nothing all too fancy. So hopefully we're saving it for um for the end of the video. But um check the code too. Once again, appreciation for the design on the back of the codes. A little bit of effort taken into that. It's a very minor detail, but I appreciate it. I appreciate it. But we have a ducklet with roost and rain splash. We've got a pansir, a rog and roller, a basculin, a sawaddle, a bianca. What was that? What does that one say? It says draw cards until you have six in your hand. That is cool. I like that. I like that. I like that. A goth reader, a whimsicott, an ex good drill. That one is a hollow in the set as well. I can tell by the artwork. It, it has Metal Claw and Drill Run. That one is a reverse rare. So that is awesome. And an Unpheasant. So cool. I completely forgot about this. This is the male Unpheasant art, which looks pretty cool. You don't see this one all too often. They like to appreciate the female art to this one a lot more. But it has 120 HP with Tailwind and Feather Strike. Yeah, not bad. Not bad. But once again, still nothing all too crazy yet. But we have saved the best for last, so hopefully, hopefully, hopefully this next Destiny's pack can come through with the goods. Because like I was saying, it's feeling pretty thick. Hopefully it's not a, a deception, I guess you could say. And it can come through with the goods. So let's open this one up. Once again, awesome code cards. Love these black and white series code cards. Designs on the back. There is the code. And let's go. Three and two. And let's hope for not a hashtag classic amity opening. Hopefully we can get something out of next destinies. So we have a Blitzel, a Pansage, Shinx, Pansir, a Pidav, Basculin, a Luxio, we've got a Prism Energy, a Duramaka with Hammer In, and the rare, the final rare from this box is. An Articuno Hollow. So we did save the best for last. But once again, nothing all too, too crazy. But this Hollow is really weird. It is so weird. Um, so it has the liney Hollow foil pattern, as you guys can see, just up there. Hashtag Team Mystic, by the way, in the comment section below. Um, but then it kind of just, like, stops down here. If you can see, it, there's, like, a line there. And the Hollow foil kind of just stops. And that's it. I don't know if you guys can really see that on cam. But yeah, the hollow kind of just goes down to here and then goes, nah, and then like fades out, but then it's slightly through the that section as well. A little bit strange, but anyway, I could um, go on for that for a little while. But it does have 120 HP with Ice Beam and Ice Wing, so I wasn't deceived by how thick the pack was. It just, yeah, wasn't the thickness that I was hoping for, if you know what I'm saying. We are hoping for that, that ultra rare thickness, but um, let's recap what we got in this box today so we got the reverse rare of a hollow being the ex excadrill and then we got the hollow articuna out of that last pack there hashtag last pack magic and then of course we got the featured hollow being this curum 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 but yeah once again we'll just have one last look and appreciate this curum figure awesome awesome figure be sure to let me know in the comment section below what you guys think of this figure but that said, once again, nothing all too crazy out of um, an Amity opening. We just can't get on that good luck streak. But with that said, 
Regardless, if you guys enjoyed today's opening, be sure to drop a like down below. I really enjoyed cracking into these older black and white series packs. Let me know in the comment section below if you guys would like to see some more black and white series openings on the channel. And with that said, um, I guess I'll see you guys in another one of my Pokemon trading card game openings. Thanks for watching. Peace.